Warning, the following footage does not pertain to all audiences. All footage shown in this film is fictional and has no connection with real life. All footage is simulated to mimic real life situations. All footage is created and simulated using the video game Grand Theft Auto V. Gore, violence, strong language, and psychological nudity can be found in this film. Viewer's discretion is advised. Rated 13+. So what I want you to do, turn off the engine and throw the keys out of the window. Ma'am, you have the right to remain silent, and if you say it can only be used against you in a court of law, you have the right to an attorney, you can afford one, uh, one will be appointed to you by the province of Ontario. Uh, with those rights in mind, uh, do you understand them and wish to speak to me? Adam 13, code 99. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for me? When you were in your bad trades, you go to school and learn the golden rule. So why are you acting like a bloody fool? If you get hot, then you must get cool. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? Or what you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? Or what you gonna do when they come for you? Hello everybody, welcome back to LSPD4. We're going to be on the Barry uh, we're going to be on the Barry Police Service today. And I am here standing in front of this ambulance, but uh yeah, we're not gonna be driving this. Though it is a very good looking Toronto ambulance. Not too sure what it's doing here in Barry. Anyway. We're gonna be driving this Ram 1500. I think this is a twenty nineteen. Ram 1500. Anyway, this thing is a beauty, as all the cars I use. And that is, let's see, Constable James, I guess. It could work. So, this thing doesn't have very much light on it, it's just. Uh, stage 1 is that light, stage 2 has the extra light there, stage 3 has the extra couple lights there, and... Does it even have backlights? It doesn't even have... Yeah, it doesn't even have tail lights. So, I guess I can just do this. Although it looks more like hazards, and I'll be brake checking all kinds of civilians on the road, so I I shouldn't do that. Anyway, James, let's get on in, and we can head on duty. Three like in twenty one. Show me ten forty one ten eight. Ooh. Okay. Ten four copy. 10 for dispatch. Uh, 3 Lincoln 21, I will be here with uh, 2 Lincoln 16. We'll be active Union 1 if not, all, if not already taken. 10 4. 10 for dispatch. Show Union 1, 10 41 tonight. What? Hold on. Okay, there we go. So, Dispatch really does not like the more specific ways of wording, so, not too sure why. But, let's go ahead and activate our ALPR light. All kinds of trucks transporting all kinds of different things from all kinds of different companies. They just keep coming, look at that. Damn, it's some kind of convoy of trucks. Man. That was cool. I mean, it kind of me it, it kind of reminds me of the convoy that uh that happened through Canada. Oh, that's right registration. It was during the coronavirus where uh truckers were demanded to be vaccinated from the coronavirus. And pretty much truckers didn't want to get vaccinated, so they just protested against it. I need to get in here. Come here, Pounder. Uh, 
Come here. Don't be trying to break check me. I'm not Granger with it's expired registration. That that guy is lucky because now I'm stuck with this dingus. No, you don't. You are not going to shoot to kill. Okay, is this guy gonna straighten himself out, or am I going to have to straighten him out for him? You know, I'll just straighten him out for him. Because I hate pulling over semis for this exact reason. Oops. There. Union 1, show us on traffic stop. Postal is going to be three, uh, 3016 US Route 1. Go ahead. 10 for dispatch. Uh, we're going to need zero. Uh, we're going to need zero extra units. Again, that is no extra additionals. 10 4. 10 for dispatch, let me make contact now. 10 for. Okay, just be careful with this. And I'm not able to use Compulate in here, am I? No. Hey James, uh, you mind if I use the MDT on your side? Because. What the hell? My side is gonna be. Yeah, it's like very congested with traffic, so. It's best that I do it on this side. Okay, so the power belongs to Claude da Silva. Oh, well, expired status, uh, expired registration status, and expired insurance status. That's always fun. Owner's Claude da Silva. Oh, he has a warrant for his arrest and he's on pro. Huh? Everything is expired. Driving with revoked license with felony. So he is aware that it's. Oh. Okay, so. I assume that it was first suspended, then it was revoked? I mean, that is what I'm getting at. Uh, yeah, because then there's the expired 387 days, he's on parole. Yeah. Union 1, we have an active arrest warrant. It's going to be on US Route 13016. It's going to be on the uh, Penske Pounder that we just pulled over. Uh, we will be requesting no Code 5. It's going to be too heavy on the traffic. 10 4. 10 4 dispatch. Uh, traffic is already crashing in on itself. Uh, can we slow down traffic? Negative dispatch. Show me on traffic stop. Find dispatch. Ten four copy. Dispatch make me look bad. Okay, there we go. So James, uh, this is how we're gonna do it. Uh, so he does have an arrest warrant on him. It's for driving uh, without a. It's gonna be driving with a revoked license. That's a felony. So we're gonna have to like pull him out that way. I say we just. Uh, I'll go non-lethal, you can go lethal, okay? Just make sure it's him. Yeah, that's him. God, out of the car, now! Out of the truck! Stop! Police! I'm going lethal as well. You little dick. Out of the truck. LSPD, don't make me shoot ya. Get out of there. Police, stop whatever the hell you're doing. Get out of there. Stop, police. Get those hands up! You piece 
Jesus Christ. There you go. About time you actually got out of there. I got him, James. There you go. Okay. Well, let's get him quickly back over to the truck. Okay. At this time, you have the right to remain silent. Claims you say can be used against the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can't afford one, one will be appointed to you for your charge by the Ontario Court of Justice. Have those rights in mind. Do you understand them? And would you speak any further? Okay. For the time being, uh, face away from me at all times. Do not turn back and continue to face at my windshield, okay? Do not turn back. And don't break the cuffs, will you? Stop breaking them. Stop breaking the cuffs. <laughs> I just keep nudging him over and keep causing him to break the cuffs. Okay, an empty bottle of uh, cardiac rye whiskey. So, it was on him? So, it could mean that he is possibly drunk. Okay, uh, let's just do a quick breathalyzer test. Just to see if you were drunk while driving. Appreciate it. Hmm. Okay. I guess it might be an old bottle. Okay, let's do what's in the car. In the semi. I keep saying car, even though it's not a car. A British CX-4 Storm Carbine. Uh, black garbage bag containing the remains of a cat. What? An unopened bottle of lager beer. And a laptop. Why do you have the remains of a cat? What the hell? What the hell, Claude? Do you have a do you have a gun license for it? The remains of a cat. That is still considered animal abuse. Yeah, so I can get it for that. Let's go. Uh yeah, he doesn't have a gun permit, so. Again, it is illegal possession of a weapon, although, if he did actually have a weapon in a truck, it, I think it is considered legal. I'm not too sure about that one. Okay, so, uh, firearms is going to be down here. Where else will be? No, it's not here. Uh, firearms. Can't tell if it's possession of a stolen one. But let's just, uh, so there's misc, uh, misc offenses, miscellaneous. Uh, yeah, it doesn't have any animal abuse in here. It's not a court violation, that's for sure. Actually, a uh, violation of uh, probation, no, it's parole. Violation of parole, because you don't have your parole officer with you. Your parole officer is supposed to be with you. Uh, and you are definitely going to be going back to jail because you were let off on parole and you are driving with everything expired and revoked. Considering now you also have a warrant on you which only makes things worse. Okay, here we go. So, these are the arrest charges. I got him for a violation of parole. Resisting arrest, non-violent, fleeing or attempt to loot LEO, driving with a suspended uh, license, uh, with knowledge and driving to a suspended license, suspended or revoked again here it's for both and then 
uh, DWI commercial license was prior to this. It was from a, another arrest. Possibly what got him his parole. That is possibly what happened. But anyway. Those are the charges that he got. Come on, close the door. Thank you. And you. Come on, let's go. Over here. You are going to have a seat right here. And this is a Ram 1500, mostly untouched, so those seats are going to be pretty comfy. As opposed to other vehicles where the rear seat is just metal to the butt. So, let's go ahead and get insurance for this. Union you know, 1 requesting insurance to 3016 US Truck 1 for a uh, yellow Penske semi. 10 4 copy. Yeah, it is Penske. And I gotta get up closer to the driver's seat here. Get insurance for that. Assistance required. And Palato Bay. $25,000 fine for littering? Damn, how bad, how bad is the littering out here? I mean, no wonder there's no litter anywhere. No wonder. Okay, where is that insurance car? There it is, coming up. Okay, come on, James. In the truck. There you go. Okay, just gotta wait for them to take the truck, and then we can go. Hey, Claude. Uh, yeah, you might want to say your last goodbye to this thing because you won't be seeing this thing again. Yes, I know it's yours, which is why I want you to say your last goodbyes. There you go. Okay, here we are. Uh, hold on, the, yeah, the delivery spot is at the front, I forgot, it's not back here anymore. Actually, I don't think he was ever back here, was it? I don't think so. Oh, wait, no, there's, yeah, there's one over there. Okay, let's just be careful through here. And we can bring him over here. Okay. Well, you didn't see that. You didn't see that. No, you didn't. Let's go. What if, like, smoking lettuce got you high, but no one knows? Because no one's ever tried it. Huh? I don't give a shit. <laughs> Smoking lettuce? <laughs> that is so strange to think about. Damn it! Smoking lettuce. Gravity is like the most far out thing ever, man! Who cares? <laughs> yeah, those guys are definitely high. Yeah, come on, constable. In. No! Hmm? Uh, stealing, stealing several items from the El Rancho Boulevard Robus Liquor. Uh, Great Ocean Highway is going to be an olive green holler. Okay. 
Uh, olive green holler. Doesn't look like the holler is around here. That doesn't look olive green. Is this still back there? I think we found it. Union 1, I believe we have eyes on the olive green hauler. Uh, we're going to be at 3016 US Route 1. Uh, I'll be attempting a, uh, I'll be attempting a traffic stop now. Attention all units. We have citizens report a civil disturbance. Yeah, get that to someone else. I'm busy with the bolo right now. Come on. Did I pull over the wrong guy? Yep, I located the suspect. A firm dispatch. I found the suspect. Uh, we're going to be at 3008 US Rock 1. Okay, where is this guy gonna stop? Okay. Don't you dare. You might just pull this guy over right now. Not even pull him over because clearly he doesn't want to pull over. Unless I have to do it like this. There we go. Yeah, now he's pulling over. Really? Okay, you know what. Oh, you are smart. Uh huh. Union 1, we're going to be at 3005 uh, Toledo Belvet. The vehicle is going to be here uh, impeding traffic. We'll be attempting to pull him up now. 10 4, copy. 10 4, dispatch. Show us Union 1 10 6. Eh, 10 7 works. Hey! LSPD! Don't make me shoot ya! Out of the car. You idiot. Get out of the truck. Come on. This is the police! On the ground. Lay flat on the ground. Why do you have a helmet on? Excuse me, I'm late. Can you move? Rapid involuntary eye movement. Okay. If you dare touch my car, you will be arrested too. Okay, let's get this thing searched and out of here. An unloaded Colt M4 Trooper Patrol Carbine. Hmm. Uh, a road sign, uh, a roadside emergency kit, and an Eagle Chaser energy bar for the hauler. Okay. Come on, what's the hold up? Union One requesting insurance to Polito Belvet three zero zero five for an olive green hauler. Um, 
Lato Boulevard. Thank for this fight. We gotta get this thing out of here quick. It's blocking traffic all over. And idiots just wanna get through. I don't care how much you damage that thing, it's not mine. And you're also damaging your own car. Let's just get insurance over here and then we can handle it. Then we can handle this guy. You're a serious idiot. <laughs> okay, let's get. Yeah, come on. Just get this thing out of here before I lose my mind from all this noise. Right on, thanks. There you go. Oh, now you're blocking him, aren't you? Hey man, just floor it. I don't care if you rip the car apart. It's not mine. I think he has room. It's probably just this guy blocking him in. Wait up! There we go. Out of the granger. So I want you to shut up, sit tight, and we're gonna get this thing out of here. Got that? Shut up, sit tight. We're trying to get this thing out. Oh, is it because of the traffic stop that he can't move? It's probably it. He doesn't have enough, like, torque. I think the game took it away or something. Okay, he's on his way. Don't start another, please. Hey, uh, you wanna hold on to him real quick? I'm gonna be issuing a citation to him soon. Okay, you... Let's go over here. I'm gonna have my partner pat you down so that my eyes don't break, so. Just go ahead and stand here. Uh, let me just read your rights. You have, uh, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can only be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can afford one, one will be appointed to you free of charge by the Ontario Court of Justice. Having those rights in mind, you understand them and wish to speak any further? Okay, go ahead and stand here. Don't move. Uh, I'll give you a little more room. Yeah, just go ahead and stand there. Don't move. Uh, face my windshield if you can. Okay. Uh, James, can I pat him down? Come on, James. There you go. Yeah, you've got him uh, pat him down. Okay, that's for you. Go ahead and uh, stand up for me. There you go. So, do you have any identification on you? Hey, you. you got your ID? Thanks. Uh, Jazzy Baines, an open bottle of Cardi Green Apple Whiskey, a card with uh, lawyer Molly Schultz. Uh, and a can of E. Cola. Okay. So, do you have any information for the car? Uh, any license registration, curb insurance? Union 1, requesting 1028 for a black and colored Granger. Plate's going to be 48 Lincoln Adam Howard 382. Suspect's license plate, Lincoln Adam Henry. Okay. Yeah, it's uh, clean. It's clean. Oh, uh, no. Let me just go ahead and make a citation for it. I thought I told you to face the... Dude. Turn away. Oh! A warrant for nighttime burglary. Wow! Wow! That is amazing! Just amazing! Wow! 
How lucky of us that the idiot who was bashing into the wheels trying to get through was the very idiot that had a warrant for nighttime burglary. <laughs> that is just amazing. Okay, it, it's not an arrest report. I don't know what I'm doing. It's supposed to be... Actually, yeah, he is going to be arrested, but it's going to be multiple citations as well. Uh, motor vehicle operation. Yeah, leaving the surface of roadway, technically. Uh, careless driving. Uh, failure to yield while entering the roadway, no. Yeah, the rest is about the... Uh, it's a rest. So... No notice to appear, it's just going to connect with the court. And then the arrest report. Okay, so that's citations, careless driving, leaving the surface of roadway. And there is also nighttime burglary, which I hit him for the warrant. Uh, destruction of private property, reckless driving, and negligent driving. So that is all of him. Then George Lopez. Oh, look at that. His license expired for 182 days. Okay. So you. You're under arrest, you piece of crap. Yep. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you can afford one, one will be appointed to you free of charge by the court of justice. Having those rights in mind, do you understand them and wish to speak any further? Okay. Let's go ahead and face the transformer there. Uh, Jay and Tony, go ahead and get you to pat this guy down as well. Before only my eyes break. Okay, I don't want to risk my eyes breaking. This is a really good scene that we're getting out of this. I don't know how you plan on patting him down to the transformer. But somehow you managed to get to the transformer and are now invading his personal space just to pat him down. A car arm, CM45 pistol, and several meteorite bar wrappers. Okay, let's see what's in the car. Since it's a nighttime burglary, I. Uh, three boxes contain 24, uh, 30 milligram uh, pseudofidrine uh, tablets each. Uh, then there was a plane ticket to Las Venturas, a case of uh, Kasama beer. Yeah, so we're going to need a search warrant for his house to see if there's anything there that he's stolen. I'm not too sure if it really matters unless it has people's names on them. We could trace them back to the serial numbers, figure out uh, who bought what. But anyway. Uh, your arrest is not done yet. Yeah. Okay, so it was for an active bolo for stealing liquor. Uh, firearms? He didn't have a firearm, did he? Let me go check. Yeah, uh, he did. He had the Colt M4 assault rifle on him, which, that is a long arm, not to mention he doesn't even have any gun permit, so. Firearms, let's go ahead and get the illegal possession of a firearm. Uh, is it registered to him at all? Check the port. I know it said, a uh, Trooper Patrol, so it must have been, like, from America or something, but... Let me just see if it's his. Because if it's Trooper Patrol, then... It is... Yeah, it is his, right? Hold on. Oh no, that's car arms, yeah. Yeah, the car arms belongs to you, okay. So... Yeah, that thing is gone. So, for some reason, I guess I left the gun in the car. Not too sure why. 
But since it's a trooper patrol weapon and it's issued to a specific police department, and you are over here driving trucks, I'm going to assume that it wasn't yours, so I'm going to go with illegal possession of an automatic weapon. Because as soon as it's proven that you're not a cop, then it's going to be immediately proven that the gun is stolen. It's stolen, it's not yours. Uh, unlawful possession of a firearm. Not misdemeanor, it's going to be felony. Um, illegal possession of a dangerous weapon. No. Where is illegal transport? I can't hit him with stolen firearm yet. Can't be the someone else who does it. I'm gonna investigate it. Where's transport? Here we go. Found it. Okay, so it was that, and then there was the robbery and theft. Yeah, robbery and theft. Uh, that's burglary. And that's just robbery. Robbery of the liquor, that's why the bowl was put out on them. Yeah. Actually, robbery and robbery. Okay, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. I'll have to remove that later at some point. Okay, just go ahead and throw that in. So, unlawful possession of a firearm, unlawful transport, illegal possession of an automatic weapon, and robbery. Then there was also the uh, driver's license, which I can also just uh, quickly throw that onto him. Uh, it's gonna be a misdemeanor. Driving with license expired, one year plus. It was 397 days, so. Oops. There we go. Oh no, it was. No, yeah, it was 182 days. Okay. Oh, it's on it now. And then Jazzy Baines, nighttime burglary. The weapon wasn't supposed to be on him, but let's just go ahead and throw that on him as well. Okay, there we go. Just make sure that it's on him. I I just want to make sure that you have everything that I'm not missing anything, so both of these guys can head over to uh I guess it's straight to the prison, right? They go in for booking, go straight to the prison. Union one requesting police transport for two suspects. Suspect license plate Lincoln really? Adam Henry. <laughs> no. Union one requesting police transport. Suspect's license plate oh, Lincoln for the love Adam of God. Henry. Come on, police transport for two suspects in one vehicle. Assistance required in Palato Forest. There they go. Okay. Ah, uh, if you guys go. Okay. I gotta get this thing out of here too. You know, more requesting 1051-23005 Pluto Velvet for a black ranger. Uh, small tow truck should do. Tow truck. Assistance required in Palato Forest. And if a small tow truck doesn't manage to do it, which, uh, there it is, I should probably change the models, the vanilla, it's a vanilla tow truck. I should probably change the model, but if it can't, where are you going? Where are you going? Thanks so much. I think that's the insurance guy still there. Yep. But a bit too much pressure on the gas. But I don't like this fictional stuff. There we go. Uh, 
Okay, well, you can deal with that. I think it's a bit too big for that, uh, that tiny thing. So let's just, yeah, let's just get out of there. Okay. Really? I have to right away. You know one responding. Okay, yeah, I can head over there. It's right here anyway. You know one, I'm right here around the corner, you can show me on scene. Ten four copy. Ten four dispatch, show me on scene. Ten four copy. Really? Come on. You know one, show us on scene. Please. Thank you. Oh my god! No! Not the priority traffic. No, no, no. Raise the air. It's not raise the air, it's uh, lift the air. This flash lift the air. Thank you. Okay, let's head over. Union 1 will be making contact with Landorn there. It's over here, or... Go ahead. I don't know what, just... 10-6. 10 there. Copy that. Three. Lincoln. 21. Oh, maybe it's back here? There we go. Okay. Hey officer, I appreciate you coming so quick. No worries, what's going on here? So I've got a tenant living here who I advised 30 days ago that I'd have to move out. They were very upset by this, but I have a legitimate reason, and I've given them enough. Uh, I've given them enough notice to get out. According to Ontario State uh, Provincial Law, they have 30 days notice to leave, uh, which they have received. Okay. Uh, have you been able to enter the house? No, officer. I have a key, but they deadbolted the door from the inside. Are they allowed to do that? I don't think so. I'm done wasting time with them. Please get them off my property, officer. Yeah, I'll, I'll talk to him. Hey, can you please open the door and come out here? It's police. You're trespassing. No, officer, I will not. I'll not be unlawfully evicted from my own property. This is not your property anymore. Look, uh, let's at least talk to this. Let's not make this any harder than it has to be for anybody here. Okay, fine. I'll come out, but you better not arrest me or unlawfully search my property, officer. I will not be mistreated. Of course, just come out here and talk. There you are. Thank you. Are you aware that you, at uh, the 30-day period for moving out, of the property has expired? Yes, I am, officer. I want it to be out sooner. I haven't been able to move all my stuff out yet. I should be able to get it out tomorrow, if that's okay with you. Uh, most of it is already gone. Okay, but it seems like your landlord is pretty upset about the whole thing. Yes, I understand. I'm really sorry. Uh, if you could, just give me one more day and I'll be out. Okay, let me see what I can do. So, I guess, that wide-eyed landlord, <laughs> look at his eyes, that wide-eyed landlord, he hasn't heard a thing about this. Alright, I talked to the resident, they have a new place, and they're almost ready to leave. They just needed a couple more days to get their stuff ready, and uh, most of it has already moved out, is that okay for you? Uh, can I call you guys back again if, they still, if they're still here after then? Absolutely, you're well within your right to have them removed now, but if you can spare a couple more days, it'll be easier for everyone. Alright, officer. That sounds fair enough. Hopefully this is over soon. Awesome, I appreciate the cooperation. Glad you were able to find the middle ground. 
Alright, hopefully this turns out okay. Thanks for your help. Well, now it's fun. Attention all units, we are code four. And for this fetch host code four. Okay, so that's going to wrap it up for this video. If you did like to feel please uh please leave a like while this watch is interrupting my outro. All units no. we've got a hit and run in no. Palato Forest. If you guys did like this video, please give a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel and do turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss another video from me. And do you leave a you leave a comment as it does help with the YouTube algorithm because YouTube does not like to treat my videos very well. And other than that, you guys have yourselves a great day, and bye-bye.